in this video i will share my youtube recommendation the channels which i think will help you to proceed in your preparation and help you to understand the concepts better disclaimer these channels which i am recommending are the ones that i have used personally and i know these channels will help you definitely if the channels that you watch and the channels which you like is not here please don't feel bad for that these are the channels which i have used personally and i know there are plenty of good channels out there other than the channels that i am mentioning here so no hard feelings for anyone whose channel is not here hello everyone welcome back if you are new here i am shunidhi v prabhu i am a first year medical student in bangalore medical college and research institute watch this video till the end because at the end i will make a special point on how not to get lost in youtube and how to get maximum benefits out of youtube one of the best youtube channels out there to guide the students who are preparing for competitive exams let that we need je main or kvpy is none other than shrinidhi v prabhu channel yeah you heard it right it is my channel <laughs> i am trying my best to guide you all i am trying to uh, not let you all face the same problems that i had faced during my 11th and 12th standard and i hope this channel is helping you to make a huge impact in your scores thereby your results in neat exam if you have not subscribed yet please do subscribe like and share this channel so it may help many more students and they can also get benefited from this channel so getting into subject wise channel for physics i used to use physics galaxy by ashish arora sir sir teaches really well if you are scared of physics especially you can easily lean on to physics galaxy and the content how it will be is first sir will explain how a concept works explain properly about the theory and explain why we are using it that was, that is a important thing in physics first you have to understand the concepts really well then you have to proceed on with the problems so the sir first teaches the concepts then give examples for that concept so that you can understand the concepts better so it will really help you to proceed on with the books that i have mentioned in my previous video so that was my first recommendation physics galaxy first watch the videos and solve problems from the books that i have mentioned i would like to mention two more channel for physics that i saw has good content physics wala and ssp sachin sir physics both of these channel has good content even though i have watched a small number of videos from this channel but it has really good content so it is upon you guys you can choose whichever channel best for you coming to chemistry for physical and inorganic chemistry er dushyant kumar sir from helios edco sir teaches really well and the enthusiasm and energy of the sir makes you to love the physics physical chemistry and inorganic chemistry anytime padai academy from vinit katri sir for organic chemistry and even i used to watch sachin rana youtube channel for organic chemistry atp it has really good contents and each and every doubt if you have any doubts regarding any mechanisms you can watch find a video out there and the concepts that sir explains it it will be really concise and simple but you will get most out of those videos even sachin rana explains really well especially coming to the reactions mechanisms and the problems solved in je main and je advanced so if you are really interested in organic chemistry you can go ahead with atp and uh, sachin rana channel and for biology i don't think for biology you require a youtube channel or require any guidance because in ncert it is really simple to understand you can really get away get along with biology for with ncert itself but if you feel you need to watch videos if you need to wa watch videos to clear your concepts you can watch vipin sharma tutorials i think now it's uh, changed to ozone classes but i don't recommend you to follow any youtube channel for biology because i feel biology is really simple you can get away with it don't waste too much time watching the videos which you already know the concepts so that was my recommendation for physics chemistry and biology for guidance based channel that is my channel 
So if you haven't subscribed yet, please do subscribe. Just like every other social media, you can easily get distracted in YouTube too. As you can find so many positive end for YouTube, there is lot of negatives in YouTube too. So you have to be very careful which to use. So my first tip to not to get distracted in YouTube is switch off that autoplay button. When you switch off it, you cannot, the video stops after that video itself. It won't continue for next video. What I used to do to our distraction in YouTube is I used to watch YouTube videos only when I was having break. Let that be break for breakfast, dinner, lunch, or even break between two different study session. If you don't know what I'm talking about study session, please watch my previous video about daily timetable. You can get a clear idea about how study sessions work. And one more thing that I want to mention here is don't waste too much time watching YouTube channels for a same topic. Let's say you are watching a topic from electrochemistry. If you don't know the concept properly, you watch from channel A, but there is channel B, which also has made content about the same concept. It will be recommended for you in the YouTube, but you don't want to get distracted by watching the second channel too, because once you have watched a video from one channel, once you have cleared your concept from one channel, I don't feel it is necessary to waste your time watching the same content again, again and again. It will just make you more confused and you will start losing more time. So be wise and choose what is best for you. I know there are a wide range of good channels out there. You may like the channels which I don't like. You can, there are pretty good channels. So. I'm not recommending you to just follow these channels that I have mentioned. These are the channels that I have used personally and I know them well. But if you feel other channels are good, go ahead and pick them. But just stick with small number of channels. Don't follow each and every channels that is on YouTube and follow each and every advice that they give. You, you, are, you will be doctors of tomorrow and think for yourself. Okay. Take a time and do what is best for you. Just don't follow because I am telling you or some other teachers are telling you. Follow it because you feel that is best for you. So make sure you won't get distracted very easily. And please follow the daily schedule that I have mentioned. It will be of much help for you, especially nowadays that you have online classes going on. You have a lot of time in your home to study for yourself and hope you guys make best out of it. That was it guys from my side for this video. Hope it helped you in some way to get familiar with the YouTube channels that I have used. And I hope these channels will help you to grow more and succeed in a positive way for your preparation.